This is the new AlphaCool XPX Aurora Plexi Digital RGB Eyes Block. And what it is, is it's their new XPX version of the eyes block that has digital RGB and an updated look. Uh, it actually looks really, really nice. Um, and inside of the box for this particular model, you have the instruction manual, as you can see, uh, but you also get the fancy new block as well as all of the mounting hardware. Uh, so this new block is actually pretty much exactly the same as the XPX uh, to the previous version, the XPX eyes block. However, they have made some pretty incredible aesthetic uh, improvements on it. Uh, one of the first things that you'll notice is that this has this chrome ring around it. Uh, there's two different versions that they have, the chrome ring version and the black ring version. Um, but they have this new black edge that's uh, a little bit recessed and has the logo inside of it that is pretty fancy looking as well as this new like very smooth and shiny edge that goes all the way around it uh, that is obviously addressable RGB uh, LEDs that are inside of there. Now in order to connect uh, this unit to any of your uh, any of your digital RGB stuff, you're going to need the cable that's actually inside of the hardware kit. Uh, now, inside of the hardware kit, you have all of the mounting uh, things for the AMD so socket setups, which uh, comes with the AM4 bracket, as well as the Intel bracket, uh, and they come with the chrome-plated versions, which are pretty sweet looking as well, uh, as well as the Intel uh, backplate mounting plate for the uh, CPU. Um, but on top of that, you have your your spring kit, um, the the cap covers, which is pretty neat. So the cap covers come with the uh, the CPU kit. Um, but this cable here is actually what you're going to need more more importantly than anything else. Uh, this is the five volt uh, digital RGB adapter cable that allows you to connect the proprietary end into any of the five volt addressable controllers or the five, uh, five volt addressable port on your motherboard. Um, so as you can see, I just took that adapter cable, which is included again in the hardware kit here um, and plugged it into the alpha cool end. And then all you'd have to do is either plug it into a controller or into your motherboard. Um, and sold separately if you'd like to purchase a controller that will handle everything without having to deal with the motherboard you can purchase one of these which is the alpha cool digital rgb controller uh, which has three different buttons on it um, but in order to connect it all you do is line up the pins plug it in and as you can see it's doing a fancy effect but uh, this block looks pretty incredible uh, especially with the new led ring and the uh, chrome chrome housing all the way around and the neat part is the housing actually kind of like sits around it uh, almost backwards um, so it has a nice uh, uh, chamfered edge that goes all the way around it which is a uh, pretty pretty neat looking um, but this controller allows you to do a couple different modes different colors um, but um, more importantly you can hook it up to multiple items um, so on the end of the cable here it's kind of a y split um, which allows you to connect again multiple products so say you have one of these um, chrome hard tube rings here uh, you can connect this by connecting the proprietary end into the y split here and then providing it some power And as you can see, it's doing the lighting effect uh, as it should. Um, and then you can change the color, change the speed, change it to pretty much do whatever you'd like it to. Um, but this is the new eyes block and it is pretty fancy looking. I, I'll tell you, it, it, it's incredible to look at. It's, uh, it glows very well. And because it's chrome and shiny and everything like that on the outside, it really gives a nice effect uh, when it's implemented into the water cooling. Um, again, it's available in chrome, uh, this chrome edge that you see here, or available in black as well. Um, and would be a great addition to any water cooling build.